I was always very pragmatic mm -hmm. at, at the end of the day. Mm -hmm. um, I simply said, okay, it's obvious that you have a gift. Mm -hmm. Now, where do you use it? Best. Because mm -hmm. it was always about seeing that the utilization of that gift was going to manifest itself into something worthy and something, something needed. So it just became very logical to me. Like, that has to be your classroom, mm -hmm. okay? That thing that they call the stage. Now, in order to make it effective, you must now always concentrate on your lesson plan. I learned that as a teacher. Mm -hmm. So what's my lesson plan for my stint on the stage? Well, I see what the play has to say or anything else that I'm going to act in. If I find that there is no possible way that I can convey some aspect of what the central core of my personal philosophy is, and that I have taken well over half a century to establish in the minds of people who trust me, mm -hmm. then I cannot do it mm -hmm. and won't do it. There is a reason why I won't do commercials. Why? Depending on what the commercial is. It has to be something as a public service, and I agree with the public service. You know, no, no. Okay, I'll do it. If it's to do something, and this is, this is a personal thing. If it is to convince people to do something that in life I am detrimentally against, I will not do it. Because I know that there are a whole group of people over the years who have said to me, I tell my child or I tell my grandchild, you could always believe what Mr. Borden said, he'll, he'll, he'll do that. I can't betray that. Mm -hmm. That's irreplaceable. Mm 